Welcome to Men's Style Fashion. Thank you, thank you. Who are you and what do you do? I'm Gordon Richardson and I'm the Creative Director of Top Man and I've been invited here today to be a judge at this really rather fabulous Walmart prize. What are you looking for? I think as a panel we were looking for innovation with wool. You know, it's something that everyone knows about but to be very innovative in it is very, very difficult. And I think a lot of the young designers have taken this challenge and really run with it. And they've shown us how you can really experiment with it. Some have done it very subtly and some have taken it right to the edge. It's a really interesting uh, finalist because um, the men's and the women's wear side of things were all very, very different. But there were two absolute winners that came out from the day, both in, one in men's wear and one in women's wear. Right. Can you talk about the technicality of wool? Because I people don't realise that you can wear it in summer as well. Yeah, I, I, listen, I, I'm a designer by trade, but I, I, I don't know about the technical things about it. It's very breathable, for one thing. Yeah. So, and you can blend wool with other fabrications, but even on its own, in terms of the way it's woven, it can be very, very lightweight. One of the designers today had shown a shirt in it, so that just shows you the versatility of it. Mm. Because as you know, you normally think of a great big coat, a great big thing for winter, yes. but actually, you know, it's actually incredibly versatile. And we saw trousers in wool, tracksuits in wool, so it just shows that it can also work in kind of other areas of the fashion world, so sportswear, that mm. kind of And a lot of the designers have bonded the fabrics and, and put them in sportswear fabrics. I love it all because it just, it's just so interesting what they do with this. Top man, do you yeah. use wool? We use an element of wool, but obviously a lot of our fibres have mixes of wool and components of wool within those mixes. But wherever possible, we have some limited ranges. We have a range of Lux and we have a Top Man limited range and a, and a Top Man premium range. And within those ranges, we introduce wool. Um, we've got our demographics is very young. They've just come out of graduation. What are their three top investments that you would say um, they need to sort of embrace in Top Man? You know, how... how what, in terms of what they should buy? Yeah. Well, at the moment, like, it's all about yeah. a bomber jacket and a track pan. And just like for winter, I think the big investment is a coat. Um, yeah. Because that's logical, really, that you would want to do that. But what's happening in coats is they're all becoming bigger, more voluminous. Mm. And the cuts and the shapes are interesting. So if you're going to invest in one garment, I think a coat's a really good one. Knitwear as well, where it's been... Um, very much of not about pattern. I think pattern is creeping back. So yes. there's lots of really interesting things happening. Um, I have a lot of married men or men 50 plus saying I don't really have to make an effort the way I look. I love what you're looking. How would you answer that question? Oh, that's a hard one. Just be true to your style, you know? Yeah. It, but there's nothing worse than somebody, you could probably throw that argument at me what I'm going to say, but there's nothing worse than trying to look what you, how you shouldn't look. That's probably me all over. Yes. But I think the thing is be true to your style, you know, if, and, and add things to your wardrobe as you go along because yep. you you know what looks good on you. You will yep. know what how you've been complimented on how you look. So run with that. If people say I really like what you're wearing, go, okay I'm gonna cop that, but I might just introduce a new shirt to that or a new sweater to that. Or, Love that. So it's about building the wardrobe you already have and expanding it. And this this is a bomber jacket from. This is from Top Man. <laughs> well, I just yeah, thought I'd ask. To be <laughs> the trousers from Dries Van Noten. Trainers oh, are from Top Man. So I, a, I've got a mix going on. Menswear. I'm the female voice since 2012. Where is it sitting at 2016? Oh my God, it's the best place it's ever been. Yeah. I can't. I'm so excited by menswear right now. Yeah. With London Collections Men and everything that's happening in menswear, it's just so exciting. Um, Top Man has been support, supporting young designers for yeah. many, many seasons. And now we're seeing those designers come to fruition, you know. They're in their fifth or sixth collection, they're maturing, yeah. buyers are coming in to buy them. It's never been more exciting. Oh. It's fantastic. Well, thank you very, very much. Yeah, pleasure. Absolute oh. pleasure.